Michelle Goder. I'm the clarinet teacher here at Wichita State University. And on this video today, I will be playing the 2018-2019 Allstate excerpts for you, the Mozart Clarinet Concerto. And I will also give you a few tips that hopefully will help enhance your practicing as you prepare for these auditions. If you'd like to have even more information or ask me any questions about the excerpts or even schedule a lesson, uh, you can contact me at rochelle.goder at wichita.edu. I'd like to offer you a few tips as you're getting ready for your district or all state audition. Uh, on the first excerpt, one of the challenges is uh, subdividing all of the long notes, such as the quarter notes, the dotted quarter notes, the half notes, and any long notes that are tied. Uh, so one of my favorite practice techniques for this section is to play an eighth note subdivision on all of those long notes. And it would sound like this. I'm going to go ahead and put my metronome on, and I would actually uh, rec uh, recommend that for you as well. I'm going to do quarter note equals 104, which is what your uh, music prints as the tempo. Here's the subdivided eighth note played. I would like 
like to tell you about is in this first section where we're playing down low and a lot of repetitive notes. I would suggest that the F sharp that you use be on the right hand side. That way when you're moving your fingers, you're always using the right hand. You're keeping the motion in the right hand instead of coordinating that left hand in there. And then on the F sharp, do it on the right. The next tip that I would suggest is breaking this whole excerpt into smaller sections. I think that it helps you put it into bite-sized pieces that you can more easily conquer. So the first section I would recommend would be the first two lines. And then the next line, the third line, where we're doing arpeggios up and down, that would be another section. And the next section would be the long scale. And I would stop the section there. Then the next two measures would be their own section. And so on. And then the next section, the big high arpeggios. And then after those, the thirds. And so on. And then finally, to the end. So if you can conquer each one of those skills and then stick it all back together, this section can seem a lot more friendly. Last, I'll talk to you about the three measures that go up to the altissimo range, the, the notes that go above high C. And uh, what I suggest for that section is that you take the last three notes of each one of those arpeggios and play them longer, like quarter notes. So here's a demonstration of that. Called double single slur. 
So you can get used to these notes that are jumping around and hopping around, not in a scale fashion, but more of an arpeggiated fashion. So you play it like this for the doubles. And you repeat that pattern. Then, when you're confident and comfortable with that pattern, you change it to single tonguing each one. Thank you. 